Turning to some business news now, another setback for AstraZeneca's COVID-19 vaccine and fans of casual Friday attire have more of a reason to just roll out of bed today. Diane King Hall has the details in today's Money Watch. Wall Street was higher on Thursday. The Dow rallied 305 points, closing above 34,000 for the first time. The Nasdaq jumped 180 and the S&P 500 gained 45. Massachusetts wants to ban the trading app Robinhood from the state. On Thursday, regulators asked that the company's broker-dealer license be revoked because its business practices pose a risk to investors. Robinhood fired back, saying the move is an attempt to put up financial barriers for new, young, and diverse investors. Toyota is recalling nearly 280,000 Venza SUVs from 2009 to 2015. A wiring problem could stop side airbags from inflating during a crash. The recall doesn't begin until May 31st. Toyota says it will inspect the wires and replace them if needed at no cost. Google Earth is rolling out what it says is its biggest update in years with a new feature, time lapse. It brings together decades of satellite imagery to allow users to see the impacts of climate change on the planet, specifically glaciers, beaches, and forests. Google says thanks to around 24 million satellite images, users can go back in time to witness nearly 40 years of changes to the planet. And that's your CBS Money Watch report. For more, head to CBSMoneyWatch.com. At the CBS Broadcast Center, I'm Diane King-Hall.